speaking of things that are weird and fun, we haven't done this in a few weeks, and that has made me very sad because Aww. we have missed our resident weird expert, I missed AKA you too. Thanks for having KGW's me back. chief meteorologist, be Matt Zafino. You weren't just a hand in the corner of no. the screen. The whole body was attached Thank as it is. Goodness. I was in the gorge, remember, right. for a week, so I missed that week. And then you guys were busy last week, I think. So, I know. Yeah. We're glad you all, all, all pieces of you made it back, not just your hand. So, of course, it's time for another edition of That Is So Portland. We have mm -hmm. all kinds of things since we haven't seen you in a little while. Yeah, lots of good material. I right? hear we start with something that you, you might you know, know about because it's weather related. <gasps> You know, we, we, see, we'll let's start see. with the things you're comfortable with. Okay? I haven't seen these yet, so. People in Portland are really weird. If it's 60 degrees out in April, everyone's in shorts. But if it's 60 degrees out in September, everyone is wearing sweatshirts and long pants. You know, it's all about, it's all about, it's all relative to what you've been used to and what you're coming from. That's so true. in September, we've all been used to 95, mm -hmm. so 60 feels cold. In April, it's been 45, so 60 feels warm. So, you know, but you, there is a contingency in Portland, and you see, I see a lot of them who wear shorts all year long. That's true. Right? Yeah, I mean, more power to you, but I yeah. can't do it. No. Although yeah. I do wear like dresses all year, so I guess then people look make at fun you of me with the that. pumped up kicks. Right? Just yeah. Styling. Okay. yeah. They're, they're waterproof. <laughs> okay, <laughs> what do we have next? Anybody uh, super styling? There's always some stylish people. Okay. Okay, stylish bathroom. Oh. Um, Key Portland oh, weird? weird question but mark? What's weird about that? So that's what I said at first. Like the tiles look normal. No, there's Subway a Subway tile. Uh, sh look where the shower head is. Yeah. And then look where the toilet is. Right next to it. But usually you're not using, hopefully not using both at the same time. Right. But like, I don't know. I just see that as efficient. That's you know, probably the whole apartment. That, that's like one of Portland's new that's like a New York thing. studio apartments. It probably is. So I don't know if that's weird, but I see why they sent it in. That is interesting yeah. for sure. I mean, we could like rename the segment Weird and Interesting. Yeah. Okay. Here's a post from the Moda Center because Foo Fighters were in town. They say Portland. Did you go? I did not go. You didn't get your Foo yeah, Fight on? Yeah, really close in there. That's, that's me waving my hands. I, I recognize you running from your open. Yeah, that's yeah. that's my one it's dance. Little one, it's just, right. just the running. Are you a Foo Fighters fan? Would you know the lyrics to this, this song? Is this song like Keep Portland? I, weird, no, but you know what? Know. <laughs> I wouldn't recognize Foo Fighters. Famous Foo Fighters. But this happens at Grateful Dead concerts or Dead and Company now mm -hmm. with uh, Not Fade Away. So I'm used to that. Yeah. yeah but the good for, good for Portland for singing along. That's great. Speaking of stylish things. Oh, yeah. Uh, can you? Yeah, that's just a uh, confirmation. A that bear. Is, uh, a roller blading. Topped roller blading. No, it's a bear. It's a bear? Yeah. Yeah, that's just really? a, I mean, a, a real live bear that's made of bear naked a human lady. Body. Like <laughs> since we're on the band thing. Well, there's clearly clothes yeah. there. Um, no, it's just like a stuffed bear head. Oh, it's that a, a bear person head. See, we're like yeah, moving we're up close so that we can <laughs> see that. Like, what? Maybe we should take it these full screen. It kind of looks like a pumpkin. Like someone took the pumpkin spice it's, trend. A little extra. too far. Yeah. Yeah. They're that would, You extra. know what? And we are heading into Halloween, so we should be getting a lot of good know, material I in the know. months ahead, right? That's great. What else That's we got? That's so true. You don't know if it's regular Portland or a costume. It's just Tuesday in Portland, exactly. Or Wednesday. Okay. Guy behind me in traffic today reaches forward, lifts large Hershey's chocolate syrup bottle, takes two big swigs. Oh, that is just makes nasty. Makes eye contact with me in rear, rear view, view mirror. mirror continues, continues driving. driving. Does that count as distracted driving if you're just chugging Somebody's chocolate got a syrup? Serious chocolate addiction. Let's put it that way. Is There's no other way to that say I'm that. Craving chocolate now? No, that makes sense. Do you have food coming on the show later? No, we no were just food discussing. Today? Producer Christian and I were like, "There's no food today," but can, we have a lot of cool things. Can we arrange it so the next time I'm on, we have food too? Because I'm a little hungry too. Maybe just That'd some chocolate syrup. We'll get a bottle. Yeah, for you. or salt and straw, <laughs> whatever you know. Okay, so you know, all kinds of cool foods that people make in Portland. We yeah. have a website that someone just made in Portland, yeah. and we discovered this via Reddit. But this is the actual website, so it's called "What Color Is Tilikum Crossing Right Now." Dark grayish. Right? That's what it's called, Producer Christian? So yeah, today it's dark grayish. And it actually, it says on the website, if you click in the corner, uh, it tells you how they make it. And it basically takes a screenshot, I think every 15 minutes, from the live camera of on the, the Tillicum Crossing. Bridge. Yeah. And it takes the colors that are on there and then automatically generates it to this website. Okay. So earlier it said like greenish, yellowish. That is so Portland because it's very cool? techie. Yeah, yeah, that's pretty cool. It's techie, but I also just gets you to think about the, the bridge. And I think that's outside. our I think that's our best one of the night I so far. I think yeah. it is. And I love that bridge. Uh, Enzo and I ride over that all the time. It's just so much fun. It's, it's great. so cool, especially when it changes colors. Yeah. And you look and supposedly it changes colors um, according to the water temperature and the yeah. water level. So it's all tied into that. So now we're getting like techie and you know, earth science-y exactly. at the same time. We I knew love you it. would love it. I do. 
Okay, so of course you felt the rain today. Have you gotten caught in it? Not only the rain, did you hear the thunder? Oh! Right outside the studio? Yeah! In the studio! You know what? It, it made my hair frizz out. No. <laughs> No. It's a joke. What? I was no, like, wait, okay. No, I don't know. You, you know the weather. You can't do anything to this. Okay, so I totally got caught in the weather for a while, but that means, of course, it is almost fall.